What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? Let's get into the news. Tom's Guide, which is a website, did a uh, test of what has the best camera. The Galaxy Note 9, the iPhone X, or the Pixel 2 XL. Let's talk about what they got from their results. Now, they compared a bunch of categories such as Grand Central, Greenery, Portrait, Skyline, Bakery, Flower Building, Ticket Counter, and then overall. And the Galaxy Note 9 won in three categories. That is Flower, Building, and also Ticket Counter. Overall, the Pixel 2 XL won by one point. Now, let's just look at some of these photos. The first photo is going to be the one of the ones that the Galaxy won, and it'll be the Ticket Counter. And if you look at it, iPhone X actually gets destroyed in a lot of these photos, but overall, they, they all look like pretty decent photos. But you can see that the Galaxy Note 9 just looks slightly better than all the rest of these. Another one in which the Galaxy Note 9 won was the flower. You can see the flower looks awesome on the Galaxy Note 9, not so much in the iPhone X and the Pixel 2 XL. Other than that, the Galaxy Note 9 came in second in all the other tests, and it's definitely a close uh, photo taker compared to the Pixel 2 XL, and it destroys, I feel like in a lot of these tests, the iPhone X. So if you're wondering if the Galaxy Note 9 camera improved overall, even though it has the same cameras as that Galaxy S9, S9 Plus, it definitely looks like it has because of the AI they put into the camera, and I'm excited to get my hands on it to do my own test and see if it's really improved, at least from the pictures I take on a daily basis. And the last story of the day is about the Galaxy Note 9 finally being in the hand of some users that have bought this phone. And we've been here in America, we've been waiting for our, our orders to ship in Canada and really everywhere else in the world. Well, one of my viewers in Saudi Arabia has the phone in hand. He sent me a bunch of photos on what he received. Now, sorry if I butcher your name, but it looks like his name is Jasim Bogia or Bogila. I'm sorry, I, again, I totally butcher your name, but Tells me what's in the box comes with an AKG Y50 Bluetooth headphone, a clear cover, a 3G car holder, a car charger, and the cable for the car charger. And uh, it looks like he got the 128 gigabyte version of this phone. And it's pretty cool what you get with this, with the way they present it over there in Saudi Arabia. It is really, really cool. They would never give something like this over here in America. It looks like a press kit that, that a reviewer would get here in America. It looks really, really cool. Um, and again, he got the, it looks like he got the blue phone because you can see the yellow pen and he has it in hand. And uh, he originally chose the uh, 128 is that he said he didn't he had 64 gigs on his note 8 and he didn't really need the extra space since he has that sd card and he said he doesn't need the eight gigabytes of ram since he doesn't really play high graphic games uh in saudi arabia uh, the 512 variant they add samsung little box slim for free as well so pretty cool what you get over there in saudi arabia with your galaxy note 9. Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. New videos every single day. In the comments down below, the question of the day is, what do you think about that package you get in Saudi Arabia? Do you think that is badass or no? Let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you down the road. Peace.